Do you go to BHU? And you want to know because... I was just trying to figure out why somebody would read Coriolanus for pleasure. Well, it's not my favorite, but I can't stop reading it. Are you serious? Well, not because it's a page turn, but because I have a, you know, a touch of OCD. Look, I'm a rocket scientist, but I'm just, I'm not, I'm not connecting the dots you're drawing for me. Rocket scientists are a dime a dozen around here, so if you said that to impress me... Well, uh, that was, uh, that was an attempt at nerd humor, but a failed attempt by the looks of things. Okay, I stupidly decided I needed to read Shakespeare's body of work in the order that he wrote it. And because I can't quit anything, I start until it's completely finished. I have to read this so I can move on to The Tempest. Right. Well, I've always found that with Shakespeare, the material is much easier to appreciate if it's spoken rather than read. And since I was about to head back to my lonely apartment and eat a lonely lean cuisine, maybe I could convince you to come grab a bite and I could read to you. Your lean cuisine is lonely? Yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, it's desperately missing the frozen pot pie that I ate last night. <laughs> Another attempt at nerd humor? Only if you thought it was funny. Well, I didn't. But, but the fact that you're bonding with your frozen entrees has me a little scared for you, and I think that you might need some human interaction, so sure. Let's go read Shakespeare. A posteriori, after the fact, a priori, before the fact, a verbis ad... Damn it, a, a verbis ad verbera. How do you say I hate Latin in Latin? Well, you're proficient in Mandarin. Why did you take another language again? Well, it looks good on a law school application, and I thought it would be an easy A. If I don't ace this test, there's no way I can get a 4.0 by midterms, and I'll be out of the running for the year abroad program. Everything that we planned will have been for nothing. Yeah. I've been thinking about what you told me about what Catherine said. You need to call off the arrangement you have with him. I told you if I break up with Nolan, my mom will lose her job. She wouldn't really fire her just to punish you, would she? Yes. But if, but if I can get into BHU's Oxford program and you move back to London, we can be together. If I'm gone for a year, Nolan will find someone else to pretend to be perfect with. Okay. I just... I can't let you keep up the charade if you think that he's capable of hurting someone. I will talk to him myself. We just, there's got to be a way to keep your mum out of this. No, no, you're right. Uh, I'll, I'll figure something out. I'll, I'll end it. Hi, my name is Mark Furs. I am 5'11 and I'm based in Los Angeles.